So you've been to the Tower of London before? I can't, can't remember, I can remember. I was, I was 11, when, I think, when I was, or 10 maybe, something like that. No, it wouldn't be 11, it's not earlier than that. That'd it's be been 9. Kids, it's yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I definitely was at junior school, so somewhere between 8 and 9. My mum will know. We'll ask my mum. Back in the haze. Recommend that restaurant? Yeah. Oh no, this is permanent. Hmm. Um, uh... Also <laughs> <laughs> You're not Kathleen. <laughs> 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 oh, I was not hiding. I was just doing a bit of work. Oh my god, the cobbles are so bad, aren't they? They've got some cobbled streets there, they haven't really gone to town making the um, floor any easier to walk on. Um, got stuck once, nearly tipped you out of the wheelchair, got told off for it like it was my fault. I mean, I'm not into road maintenance. And we had a look around the Crown Jewels. What did you think to the jewels then? I thought they were good. I thought the history behind them were really good. Yeah, so much of it was made mm. in the 1600s. Mm. 1666, and nearly everything had got 1666 on it. I don't know what was spectacular about 1666, but they obviously had a, a glut of gold because they seemed to turn it into all manner of things. Anyway, we came out of there, and then where do we go next? Into the cap. Oh yeah, we sat, uh, sat and had a cup of tea. And that was quite nice, wasn't it? Yeah. We got some amazing amount of food, but we couldn't eat anything because, of course, we were going for dinner. Yeah, but it looked really nice, what they so, did. So then, from there, we walked the 25 minutes or so up to the restaurant, to the London Steakhouse. <laughs> Fancy and then sweet potato soup. What do you think that'll taste like? Sweet potatoes, I suppose. But I'm not sure, but I'd like the goat's cheese, but I don't like beetroot. So. Well, it won't be a lot of beetroot in this anyway. And then, what are you having for in the States? Virginal. Yeah, yeah, I wondered about that. Is that going to have mushrooms in it? Does not it? Loads of mushrooms in it. I don't like mushrooms, I can't help it. Um, uh, I like the smell of the steak. I think we're going for the steak. Did you say you get a um, dessert in? Yeah. We haven't got that one yet then. Well, that would deserve to be. Oh, yeah, take a flask of work. Nice. Can't taste any cauliflower. You're obsessed with cauliflower. I think they always try and sneak a bit of cauliflower in everything. Very tempting, I might even have to eat that. Instead of just looking at it and taking photos. 
Oh, they all look. Cream potato looks very nice. So what's that? That's shredded cabbage. Red, uh, red cabbage. Raised red cabbage. Oh, you just took it out of that dish? Oh, sorry, I thought it came with it. I'm going to say so you've had two lots, but you haven't. No, no okay. Still haven't drunk your top cocktails yet, saving them. That tastes nice. I like that. Looks very pleasant as well, doesn't it? Don't you think? Look up to you up. What did you think to the steakhouse? And tell everybody about the steakhouse. I thought it was very good. I said it was, it was different for us because we were doing it on a experience a gift experience so we were limited to what we could have and we have to pay extra for but the food that we had was amazing it was very nice the steak was gorgeous as you'll see the um you had the version on yeah, and that was really nice um i put in and then i think we're getting a bit tired aren't we so it's you know it's because it was gone six o'clock when we left there been out since eight that morning and so we managed to make our way back down to Tower Gateway Station, jump on the DLR, back to Custom House, and here we are, back in the ship for another night. So that's us for now. Uh, tomorrow we are changing our plans slightly because we were originally thinking of going down to Battersea Station for another high-rise adventure, but um, you're not basically too bothered about getting going up in the air that high, are you? And what we also have done is buy a two-day hop-on, hop-off bus ticket, which includes a, um, a river cruise. So it would make a lot of sense, wouldn't it, if we actually use that rather than spend even more money going up to Battersea. So. Tomorrow we are heading back into the city and we're going to spend the whole day hopping on and hopping off a bus. And that sounds really thrilling. But now we have got a few places we want to go and see, haven't we? You're amazed how many places you've never been to. You've never been to Westminster? You have. So I took you in Westminster but many, many years ago. We've been in Westminster. And we are going to, I think, St Paul's? Yeah and wherever else the mood takes us. So that's what we've got planned. And then we're heading back to the car about five and then we've got to drive home. The long three hour drive back home with the 31 miles of road works, which is absolutely ridiculous because there was nobody on them at all. There was no machinery. It was just a total waste of time. But there you go. So that's us done for the moment. Say good night, because you're immediately going to sleep after I turn this camera off, aren't you? No, I've just got to put my legs up. Yeah, well, I'm going to put my legs up because I've done three million steps today. Um, and my legs are a bit tired too. So, say bye bye. See you later. Bye. 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 bye.